hey, ho, ho, ha, ha. All right, everybody, how's it going? Right then, I'm going to do a review today, and what I'm reviewing is uh, these switch grips. Now, these could be used for um, electric motorcycle, which is a 22 mil bar, or a e-bike with a 22 bar, because most the ends of e-bikes bars are 22 mil as well. Um, so I'm going to review these, and these are from uh, AliExpress, and they're from a company, I, I can't say the name, so I'll, I'll put the name by here, that's what it is, um, and they cost 26 UK pounds, I'll put by here what they cost in pounds, dollars, and euros to keep everybody happy. Ho ho! Right, so uh, I'm gonna review them and just, just look at them off the bat. Uh, they look pretty good. They don't look premium, just pretty good. Uh, so what I'll do, I'll set up the camera so it's looking down and uh, we'll go from there. So let's get on with it. Ho ho! Okay then, so what you get out of the box or whatever the wrapping's in, you get the left grip, which is, which is just a push push fit. So that's that. And it looks quite nice, doesn't it? The materials are quite nice. That looks quite durable, that does. It's not like uh, soft material, it's quite good. Uh, so we'll put that by there, like that. You get the left side switch, and then you get the right side switch with the old throttle in it. That's got a nice spring action and obviously it matches that as well, doesn't it look, see? And uh, that again, it, it feels pretty good. Now, let's, let's start with this one. And on, the, on this one then you've got uh, one, two and three settings for speed if your controller has got the uh, eco, normal and sport mode sort of functions it's got an s button there which is uh this actually uh the throttle it can it can go um it's got like a controller that'll go with this and that'll be if you hold that'll be a sport mode because that's um that's not a latching button that's that's just sort of a press doesn't latch momentarily that's the right word that's a momentarily button uh, and this one's a momentarily button as well. It doesn't latch, and that is for reverse. Um, but that will obviously, because it's a momentarily button, not latching. It might work with some controllers. It might not work with other controllers. The one that this is designed for, it does work with that. Then you got uh, these are latching side lights and headlights. So that's what's on the the plugs come like this with these and they, they've put some silicon in it to stop any water ingress and you do get a bag with the matching other connectors so you can make your own loom up so that's that there we'll come back to that in a minute then on this side here you've got left and right indicators you've got a latching uh hazard warning switch and then you've got your uh dip beam and your dazzle beam and on the bottom here you've got horn and on the website that says park if that's with your with the controller they're going to do but i'm going to use that p for i'm going to use that for what's it called you know when you flash a main beam right flash flash honk honk <laughs> anyway so that's that on top of these then it's got a eight mil uh, let me have a look. look this is eight mil and that fits in there, right? And that is for, you can fit uh, side mirrors on there. And it's got one matching on there. Now, the the, um, the brake levers I've bought, I haven't shown them yet on the uh, e-bike build, but they've got, already got mounts for mirrors, so these are obsolete at the moment. Now, if I take this apart by here, like this, I'm doing this review because I, I can't find any other reviews on these um, actual uh, switch gear. So, if I turn that around there, I don't know if you can see this, but that there has got a little 
nodules sticking out. I'll, I'll, I'll show later on the video, you've got to drill a small hole. You can, you've got two choices really. You can either grind that off and just use this, try and get it tight. Or what I did was I uh, got the same size drill for, as that and I drilled a hole in the handlebars. Some people say, oh, you shouldn't do it. Some people say, who gives a monkeys? I'm the second type, I don't give a monkeys. <laughs> so I drilled, a, I drilled a hole in my handlebars. So there we go. So that there then latches into the handlebars. And I think the reason, the reason why that has got that there is because, where's it too? It's a new one. If you put a, a mirror on you, it's quite heavy and you could get rotation. When you do that, drill a hole, there's no chance of rotation. You may just stay where you are so you can see where you're going. Well, not see where you're going, see where you've been. <laughs> anyway, so there we go. That's that one there. And um, this one is exactly the same. Like I'll show you. Exactly the same. If I can get these out. Maybe I should have took them out before I started the video, but there we go. Who cares, isn't it? It's all part of the fun, isn't it? That's got exactly the same thing there. So you've got to measure, you've got to measure out where you want them. Um, uh, what I did was I put the I put I put this on that stops there so you know exactly where it's to go and then you put you've got to put this on and that and you know exactly where to put the hole in. Um uh, what else was I gonna say? Now the one problem is I'll put up on screen now, uh, I'll put up on screen the, the the wiring diagram that's on the AliExpress website where you buy it from, and you need a magnifying glass to see the wiring, and it's hard to follow, right? But I did get I did get the gist of it. And another way, another way, if you didn't have a wiring diagram, you can you can put. Uh, uh, you can put a, whatever this thing is called by you, a digital multimeter, it says by luck. You can put on continuity like that, right? So then you can touch them two wires, press a button, and you can find out what wires do that that, that way with continuity. But saying that, I, I did all the continuity stuff, and the only, two, the only couple of wires that were a bit okey pokey was these two wires, these two switches here, when you press that, that one goes to that one, basically. And uh, I was thinking about having a quick peek inside, so I might have a peek inside. The trouble is, if I have a peek inside, it might all go a bit, uh, I hope there's no springs and stuff gonna fly out here. Sh should I look inside or not? <laughs> go on, what, what's the worst that can happen, innit? What's the worst that can happen? That's surely, that's surely just a cover, isn't it? Isn't it? It's got to be, isn't it? Let's have a look. Oi! That's just a cover, look, see, okay? So, the only problem area was these two switches. I'll turn around there. These two switches here. And it's got a green wire, a brown wire, and a blue and white wire. Now I know the blue and white wire, that goes back out and that goes up to, the, the headlight switches always go, or on motorbikes, the headlight switch on the right always goes over to the headlight dip and main beam on the left. That's always the way. I think that's always the way anyway. So I know the blue wire goes over there. and. I couldn't work out if the if the brown or the green was the earth. It does say something under there. I don't know what it says. It says I can't read it. S something F. I don't know what it is. But um, even though you'd think brown would be the earth wire, it doesn't always necessarily work out like that. But uh, there we are, you can see inside, you know, there's the switches, you can see that. I don't know if you can see that one working here. Just sliding over. Obviously you can't see this one because that's a closed 
unit. So, there we are. I think I've waffled on enough about that. So, if you're thinking about uh, buying, uh, oh, let me see there, spring. Actually, it's not, they're not bad. This is not bad. It's not bad for the money. I gotta be honest. Anyway, if you're on the market for looking out for sort of a pair of uh, throttle, a throttle body for your, not a throttle body, a throttle for your e-bike or electric motorbike or whatever. They, 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 they're a pretty good buy for twenty six dollars. Twenty six dollars. I'm not in America. I'm in the UK. For twenty six pound, they're not bad. Anyway, that's the end of my review. <laughs> right. Okay. That's the review done and dusted. That's over with. Thank God. Some people said. <laughs> but uh, if you like this video, then go on, give it a like. And if you hated this video. Go on, give it a like. <laughs> um, also, consider subscribing. I'd like that very, very much. Uh, have a look below for the... Um, there'll be a link for the series on uh, doing the old uh, electric bike build. This is part of it because, uh, you know, it's the, the, the throttle that's going to go onto the bikes. Um, what else am I going to say? Have a look at the Patreon, have a look at the PayPal, have a look at the rest of the channel. Anyway, I'll see you in the next one. Ho-hoi!